clinical pharmacy a practical approach. I thought of creating this video in sequence to assist clinical pharmacists understanding and identifying the role activities, goals, and functions to improve pharmaceutical care and patient outcome. In addition, this video might help students who would like choosing clinical pharmacy as a major. By listening to this video, these students will be aware and familiar with this field. Let me start with the definition of clinical pharmacy. It is defined as all activities undertaken by pharmacists in an attempt to promote rational drug therapy that is safe, appropriate, and cost-effective. You have to know that clinical pharmacy is not limited or unique to certain areas in pharmacy. However, it is essential to all areas in pharmacy practice. Activities of clinical pharmacists include development and implementation of individual patients' treatment plan. Patients should be assessed by pharmacists at appropriate intervals for progress toward the therapeutic goals. Clinical pharmacists should resolve and prevent drug-related problems. I will talk in details about how to develop treatment plan in a separate video. Other activities for clinical pharmacists include drug regimen review, medication administration review, patient counseling and education, and monitoring of treatment outcomes. What are the major aims of pharmaceutical care plan? First of all, clinical pharmacists should identify the potential and the actual drug-related problems. Then, they have to resolve these actual drug-related problems. In addition, they have to prevent the potential drug-related problems. You might achieve the major aims of pharmaceutical care by adhering to the following functions. First, by collecting patient data, then identify the problem, establish outcome goals, evaluate treatment alternatives, individualize drug regimens, and monitor outcomes. I will, I will elaborate more about each function in the next videos. Thank you and wish you a good luck.